freelance illustrator. I graduated from USP College of Fine Arts and Design. Um, I love I love reading comics and video games, and I like rainbows. <laughs> When Archie Comics first announced the reboot, I immediately um, got in line to purchase the first e issue, and then I I was hooked because I personally personally like Fiona Staples' work, so I'd buy her work even kahit ano ang title pa siya. So um, I ended up doing it three illustrations of Archie, Betty, and Veronica. And then I posted it on my Twitter. And then Fiona Staples commented on it. She said, beautiful. So, and then after that, um, a few days after that, um, Jonathan Bettencourt, the director of book sales, uh, messaged me with the title, Riverdale Greetings. And that's when he said that they were planning to make a reboot of Betty and Veronica, number one. I initially started um, drawing a lot of anime. I think it manifests in my work. And then when I got to college, I got reacquainted with comic books because my college professors told me that um, uh, anime style strips you of your individual style. So I kind of incorporated a bit of Western illustration into my work and I think one of my primary influences is Lisa Frank so she likes colorful works right so um, ever since I am really fascinated with a lot of colorful artwork right now I draw a lot of what's new um, basically what interests me I like playing Nintendo games so most of the time a lot of those things and I also read a bunch of comics like um, the new ones coming out with the new Wolverine and all the girl power and other than that I like drawing um, and doing a series of illustrations called Candy Girls so I kind of personify sweets and make them into cute characters something like that Drawing definitely um, amplifies that. I think that it's my outlet in a lot of things when I'm feeling down or or something like that. I, I basically draw every day. Like, it's part of my everyday life. And um, creativity, I just basically um, go to the internet and I look at my uh, art idol's work and I get influenced by that and sometimes I go I watch a lot of Pixar movies you know stuff like that and that's where I draw most my most of my inspirations